What's up you guys, Idiot Fliptronics. I'm going to be giving you guys some uh, quick tips here on how you can get more storage on your iPhone 7 and iPhone 7 Plus. So you guys, I'm going to be going through six different ways and uh, you know the biggest one and most obvious one is just to delete any apps that you're not using anymore. Uh, if you're anything like me, you'll have at least 10 to 20 of them you don't even play anymore. So obviously, just hold down on the app, you know, click delete uh, and you'll be good. But like I said, that's a big one and that's just a huge storage killer. Another thing you guys can do is uh, delete any old photos and videos you have. So, you know, um, you probably have most of your uh, photos and videos already backed up to your PC, Mac, iCloud, or maybe an app like Google Drive. So you don't really need to keep them, you know, on your iPhone if they're backed up. So just, you know, clear that out. That'll definitely clear some space. Another thing you guys could do is uh, clear out any old text message conversations. Um, you know, this is something people don't think of, but, you know, typically they start to pile up after a while. So just clear out your uh, text message conversations. Another thing you guys could do is uh, go into your settings. Um, and then you want to go to uh, music and, um, you know, get rid of any music that you don't even listen to anymore. If you download lots of music, clearing out old songs will definitely, you know, give you some more storage. I think that's one people don't think about that much. You could also go into Safari and uh, clear pretty much your history and website data. You probably have a lot in the cache on here, so depending on how long you've been, uh, you know, using your iPhone and you know searching for stuff. And if you've never done this before, that'll definitely clear out some storage as well. Um, the last thing that I actually recommend doing, and I think this is another one people don't think of, um, in the future, uh, instead of saving you know photos um, to your iPhone. Try uh, saving them to like a third-party app like Google Drive or something like that. That way you don't have to they'll automatically store somewhere else and they won't pile up on your iPhone. And I think that's a big one because, you know, that's pretty much what we use these phones for is, uh, you know, pictures and videos and that kind of stuff. So if you send them all to like a third-party app, that'll, you know, just prevent you from using more and more storage, depending on the gigabyte size you have for your iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus. Uh, those are my top six ways, you guys. Uh, all pretty simple, basic, but I think there were a couple in there people don't think of. Thanks for watching this video, guys. Please like it, stay tuned for more, and be sure to subscribe to our channel.